is up guys, my name is Rhino, I'm back for another video. So before I get started, right away, I'm gonna say thank you, thank you guys so much, so, so much for 5,000 subscribers, let's go. We, for some of you, for some people, it may not be a huge milestone, but for me, when you're a YouTuber, when you're a smaller YouTuber and you start to pick it up and you start to get really consistent, with your videos and your content, it really is a big milestone and it means a lot. Thank you guys so much. I love every single one of you. So cheers to another 5,000. And because of that, I will be doing my Unpopular Opinions video tomorrow. Yes, so tomorrow I will be basing my Unpopular Opinions set on YouTube videos and my Discord and I will be expressing them. So if you guys are watching this early and you have an Unpopular Opinion you'd like to share, that could get in the video. Don't be afraid to submit in the comments because I'm not going to berate you for your opinions. I'm not going to be Mr. Bad Guy about them. I'm just going to express my opinions on your, what you think are unpopular opinions. So once again, thank you guys so much for 5k. I cannot thank you enough. But anyway, now onto the video. We've got Daredevil. And so it was kind of obvious this skin was coming out. I know this video has been very late. I've been out with family and friends. But I still am going to try and get this video out. At least it's not a Halloween skin, because I feel like if it were a Halloween skin, that would be a bit more serious. Because I did promise I'd get all the Halloween skins, but I also said I'd get all the Marvel skins, so we're going to do combos with Daredevil and his back bling, the radar sensors. Very unique back bling, actually. For every, like, two seconds, you think you're not wearing a back bling, and then boom, just shows up. A sonic wave of energy. Pretty cool, in my opinion. I actually really like it. The Daredevil's Billy Clubs is meh. Whatever. And the Devil's Wings. Pretty cool glider, actually. I really like that animation. But we're getting onto the skin and some combos. So if I'm going to be honest, this isn't one of my favorite Marvel skins. And I would go as far as to say that before it came out, it was my least favorite. But now that it's out, now see it, it actually looks pretty cool. The horns, I love the way the head looks, the thin helmet, the eyes, and the detail in his suit. And how his pickaxe has come out of his pocket. And the Daredevil sign. I will say that when you're looking at it from distance though, this style does look like... You could just make it from one of the Boundless skins. But with the Illustrate style, it definitely looks darker and a lot different. And I feel, because it's mostly red, I feel you can still wear normal backlinks on this. It's not like the Morrow skin, where, because he has a lot of colours on him, wearing a most other backlinks that's not cartoonish or illustrated, looks a bit outlandish. But I think it looks fine on this style. So that's why we're going to show you some backlinks for both edit styles, but it's going to be the same backlinks, just so I don't take up too much of your time, because... Some of these backlinks here will look better on this style, like this one may look better on the Illustrate style because it's got its anime and it's got the bit of black there, and some will look better on this style. So we've chosen, yeah, mostly red, some black, some gold, and some blue because I will say you can stretch some blue with this skin, so some of you guys have been asking for me to showcase some pickaxe combos. I haven't done that right now, but what I will do after this is I'll get a combo to show an example, a combo with a different colored backlink. This one would go well if it showed the skin, and then I will use a pickaxe, like I'll use a blue back bling with a red and blue pickaxe to show you that you don't have to just wear red on the skin or even black. So this blue style could look good if you have a red and blue pickaxe or even just a blue pickaxe could look really cool. Deadpool's katana, so yeah, I don't typically like using too much red on him because he's got enough. I like using a back bling like this with mostly black, majority black, a little bit red or all black or a different color. Like I love the way this looks on him because he's got that triangular design going up his neck. I like the way it sits. This is what he comes with. The Mystique Skull. Oh, sorry, Ganago. I will join you in a second, buddy. I love you heaps, bro. Um, thank you for being one of my biggest supporters, by the way. And thank you to all, once again, for 5,000 subscribers. I could not do it without you guys. Without you, I would not be doing this. Your support means a lot, guys. You have no idea how happy this makes me. So cheers to another 5K. Yeah, anyway, another blue backling here. Um, pink and red, I don't know how much of that there is, but maybe you could. Some white and red as well. Yes, the Mogul Ski Bag. Pack Leader. The Quad Roller. Flame and Quad Roller looks great. Uh, Scarlet Edge. It's more pinkish red, so it would go better on this style. Sweet Spikes. Really reminds me of Meg White's drum kit from the White Stripes, don't you think? Yeah, but it looks pretty cool on him. Universal Bloom looks amazing. Probably look better on the cartoon, uh, excuse me, the Illustrated style though. Double Fang, red style. So yeah, overall, very universal outfit. You could just pretty much put anything you want on this because it's just mostly red. And because red's a very universal color scheme. But I would still recommend um, mostly black and some blue, as well as some red and black. I wouldn't put an all red back wing on. Like, this one looks good on him. And this one does too, but a little too much red in my opinion. But if you want to use all red, uh, nothing's stopping you. You can. Why the hell not? Maybe some green. Green and red with this one. 
Okay, let's just change the style. We'll quickly show you all these backlinks again on this style to give you guys an idea to show you which backlinks look better on this style and which ones look better on the other style. Yeah, that one looks better on the Illustrate style. Overall, I do think the Illustrate style is the better style because while some backlinks like this one may look a little outlandish on it with this interesting, more interesting and more outlandish design because it looks like it's from a different video game, me personally, I think it's really cool. I think it's a really cool idea. Like they already first did on Tiantina back in season two and they've already done the Moro skin and the female skin. I already forgot her name, guys. I'm sorry. Um, but even though Moro is the first time they did it on a skin where they actually made it a style, I think on Daredevil, when it comes to an actual superhero skin, like a Marvel skin, I think that's really cool because he is from a comic book. So that means they could really do it with any other Marvel skin, to be honest. Um, could they do it more? Possibly. And I'd be all in for it. Very much so. And I do think it's really cool. And I think some of these backlinks still look alright, even though this style of the skin looks like it's from a different video game. And these are all Fortnite backlinks. And even the first style looks like a Fortnite skin. Whereas this one looks like a, uh, well, a Marvel Avengers character. Like it's not even Fortnite when you look at it. But still, I do think it's really cool. And I do favour this style over the other one. I think any backlinks have some sort of animation on them is going to look better on this one because I don't know if that's the lighting or if it's actually animated, but I can see some shadows moving around as I move around, as I move the camera around. So pretty interesting thing to note there. Uh, antidote, this style, if it would show it on him. Raven's Pool Cage, that looks great on this style, whereas this one I would say looks better on the default style. I chose the Vanquishers though just because it has the cartoon style. The colour scheme doesn't match, but I guess you could still wear it to go with the cartoon theme because there's no other backlink like this other than uh, the female version's backlink, who I didn't get. Uh, this one has a bit of animation, the Noir style, and it's got the bit of red on the lips. Looks pretty cool. Rat Lantern, Scarlet Satchel. This one looks better on that style, while the first one looks better on the first style. This one doesn't look real flash on this style, though. So yeah, overall, I do think it's a really cool skin, and I definitely recommend it, if you're, especially if you're a fan of Marvel skins. If you're a fan of this season's collaboration, the Marvel skins, definitely give it a cop. Alright, so now some skins with his backlink. So, it's always going to appear. It's, you're not going to notice it's there. Sometimes it just appears. And I think that's pretty cool, if I'm going to be honest. I, if you're a person who likes to wear no backlinks, then I would still say you this is a backlink good to run with. Or maybe you might be a person who's like thinking where sometimes it's not going to be there, and other times it is, and when it does pop in there, it might distract you a little bit. I don't see that as being a problem. And on some of these skins, it may get a bit lost on. But keep in mind, it's going to look more noticeable at night time. And it's more a reddish pink, so I feel like um, not just all red. You could pretty much put it on anything you want. But it's more a reddish pink, so if you can find a reddish pink skin, like Scarlet Serpent or Red Jade, it's going to look great on it. That looks pretty good. Uh, so yeah, very, very unique backlink indeed. Is it a backlink that I'd see myself using all the time? No. But I do give Epic credit for doing something like this. A back bling that's not too obstructing at all, does not distract you, and still looks really cool. And because like literally every one second there's no back bling on, so I have no reason to see why a sweaty player who likes to wear no back blings, I'm looking at you Raptor, would not want to wear a back bling like this if they want to at least wear some back bling that's not the fucking Sunsprout. King Crab looks good on him, give him a chance guys. Heartbreaker, uh, Dynamo, sweaty skin like this, looks fine. No worries at all, I don't see why you wouldn't want to wear this backlink on Dynamo or any sweat skin. Looks great on Rue if you change the style. Yeah, that looks really good because it's more a reddish pink on her. Like, that looks really good on her, even though I'm not a fan of that skin. Swift, Crimson Elite, and it'll also look good on his female counterpart. Manic, use a backlink on Manic, you sweats out there, and Scarlet Defender. Alright, so this video is dragging a bit, so I'm pretty much going to wrap it up there. So if you guys enjoyed, don't forget to leave a like. Comment, subscribe, tell me what you think of this skin, tell me what you thought of this video. And once again, guys, thank you guys so much for 5k. I cannot thank you enough. Stay tuned for the Unpopular Opinions video. Until then, guys, I'll see you later. Take care. Bye-bye.